she Morning, like, guys. Um, it's a beautiful day outside. And, uh, actually, it's not morning, is it? What the heck time is it? Uh, child, it's 3 30. <laughs> Yes, I do. Um, I got up late today. I got up at uh, 11 o'clock. But what I'm getting ready to do is um, let springtime in. It's a beautiful, beautiful day outside. Um, the boys are already outside. I have a pretty long deck so um, I'm letting them enjoy the weather let me sit you on this tripod real quick all right there we go so I'm getting ready to let spring in and I'm doing that by taking the plastic down off the walls out here in the sunroom. That way I can come out here and really enjoy it. Um, without really having to go outside, you know what I mean? So, I'm trying to figure out how I got that up there. Hold on. So, I'm going to be safe. So, I got my little step ladder. I got stick pins in here. Alright, so we got one down. And, uh... There for now. So I'm just going to fold this up. This was uh this was a uh, old school insulation. Get ready for the winter time thing. You know what I'm saying? So I'm just gonna fold this up and keep it. For whatever I may need it for. So we're going to start on the windows now.
Can y'all still see me?
right guys so I just wanted to oh child look at the light <laughs> there go right there is that better right there so I wanted to just come in because I was just having an epiphany right and um oh child I ain't got a lot of um, battery juice so let me talk fast um I'm a Capricorn right and we don't like change so we've been out of work for two weeks 14 days and the first week I took in to process everything um, in my head right and then also within that week I uh, had to get my mind ready to have to make the change because that's what I do it doesn't matter what it is if it's off of my normal routine that's how my mind automatically works that's how it automatically goes and so did that and mm, that might be pretty sorry but I was looking at that flower right there. Maybe I could put it out there in the patio. But anyway. Um, that's how I normally do anyway. And so. The, the first part of. Because this is. Um, this is 14 days up in here. Right? Right? Y'all let me know down below. But. Um, I've just been like getting things organized and in a flow where I can work through it. So in other words, what I mean by that is now that I'm at home more, I have to have things to flow a certain way. There you go. So <clears throat> if things in my head if I feel like when I see it it's not it's not right I have to change it and I have to make it right and in order for me to get through what I'm trying to get done um hold on okay so I'm gonna try to Okay, yeah, that works. So I plugged in my camera. So I'm just going to sit here on the floor and talk to y'all. But. So that's why I'm. That's how I'm finishing up. Um, the second week of being home. And I said I was going to put together a video of. How I'm how I'm doing it how I'm you know trying to make it through it so maybe I can kind of do that right now since it's on my mind um if you guys don't mind so part of that is me getting into the swing of things and to get into a new routine right so the other part of that is, especially if you have kids at home, um, and maybe you're the only parent in the house, but this also can work if there's a two-parent home too. So what you want to do is, and what I've done is, I choose a day to say, okay, this is what I'm going to do. So today... So say today, this will be laundry day. Or tomorrow will be um, food prep day. Or uh, clean up. Like either you're going to clean the whole house or you're going to pick a room and, and do it that way. Um, today is a day where you have to make time for yourself. Meaning just get the kids something to do. For that time that you need to recoup. Right? I've been doing mine at night. 
That way I can get more doses because I'm old, I'm an older woman. And my patience is not it's not like it was when I was younger. So um, what I do is throughout the day, like during that time, that's a time for me to regroup and do what I need to do. Um, and then at night is my time as well. Now it's going to throw your whole work schedule routine off. All the way off. So you're going to have to readjust again when you go back to work. But I'm staying up later. Because I have to have that time to be able to de 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 discontinue that day. Like I have to find a way to do that. Um, also what I do is in between that day. While the kids are up. Get them a, a a project like AJ has school. So while he's doing school, um, I'll have something set up for Jamari to do. And then while they're busy, I can do my things that I need to do. And I just had to figure out a way because trying to clump everything together, it was not working. I was getting stressed out and I was like, uh-uh, nope, this is not going to work. So, that in a nutshell is what, is how I'm handling this. So, this video right here, I'm not sure if it's going to be a one part or a two part. But, um, I think I'm going to do this for, for you guys, for myself actually. And just document how I'm doing things, how I'm making it through it. Um, and that sort of thing. Because we got to use this to help each other out and to be able to um, see and that's the unique thing about this whole thing is in the past there have been um, pandemics that we have had to not us personally but our parents and their parents have had to go through right and so the good thing, the blessing about it is you can actually see someone. You can sit down and watch a video and kind of connect with that person because they're going through the same thing you're going through, right? So, yeah, that's how I'm looking at it. And so, I, I'm going to continue to do this because I you know I just asked God okay what 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 do I do what is my part what do I need to do and we have to do that we're gonna have to have this conversation with God because if you continue to listen to um all of the media and seeing all of things on Facebook and things like that I want this to be a happy spot for us to come to. You know what I'm saying? So if God is wanting me to be that vessel and to be that line of peace and comfort, then I'm so honored to, to do that. So, so yeah. Um, I will, and I'm going to show you the good, bad, and the ugly. I'm going to show everything to you, child. Alright, so... Alright, fancy beauties and bows. I'm going to let this camera charge. And I may come back. Um, while I'm cleaning the boys toys. In the middle. Or just show you the finished thing. So we'll work all that out. Just depends on how fast this camera charge back up. Alright, so I'll see you guys on the flip side. Alright y'all, so I just went ahead and brought y'all downstairs. Um, I got like a little barricade right here. Because <laughs> that's my makeup stuff on that side. And then this is where the boys play. Um, those, this is one of those times when I let them be down here without me. Um, so I can get things done upstairs. Or I could do my makeup on that side. That way I can do the 
um, kind of concentrate on the, the application of the makeup as well as um, be in the presence of the boys. So, yeah. But there are those times when I want, you know, just some Gina time. Um, is when I let them come down here and play by themselves. Not too long, because honey, ooh, it was not good. <laughs> 